An Enlo Magnet High School rising senior is doing something this summer that only 100 students across the world get to do. He got accepted to a renowned research program at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, where he is hard at work. Tonight, we're catching up with the precocious teenager. Ryan Raison is proving anything is possible with hard work, focus, and raw talent. The rising senior at Enloe Magnet High School in Raleigh, one of only 100 students across the globe to be accepted to the prestigious Research Science Institute at MIT in Cambridge, Massachusetts. There's kids from Singapore, Vietnam, like because like Kazakhstan. It's just like like meeting people and like learning about their experiences in STEM and like how it like compares to mine. In the six-week intensive program, Ryan is researching quantum photonics related to quantum computing. Science and math have always been a passion of his. Because this is kind of like a dipping your toes in kind of like the professional world in sense, like how we're working on this research. So it kind of gives me like a little bit of taste of what I'm going to be doing in the future. Mom and dad say they've been trying to nurture his interests from a very young age. He's always been a very academic and curious child in terms of solving problems and having big, strong interest in things like both the computer science and math and as well as ballet and the arts as well. You heard that right. This science guy is also big into ballet, often rehearsing 20 hours a week. To lean into it and find that interest and support them. And um, and then also, as much as you can, um, help them with um, you know school and be engaged. I think those are the things that we've done and committed to. Ryan says this intensive summer program at MIT will set him up for college applications next year. How impressive is he, right? Uh, just amazing. Congratulations to Ryan. Uh, people who have previously attended the Research Science Institute have gone on to become distinguished scientists, entrepreneurs, and professors. Quantum computing, Anthony, uh, quantum <laughs> photonic. I, I'm not even going to try to figure out what that is. I was going to say too many words. <laughs> I don't know. Kudos <laughs> to him. They're doing a great job yeah. with that. But yeah, it's, it sounds very complex.